So here we are at Northampton Audi, picking up the RS GT e-tron again. Oh my lucky boy. Yeah, off we go to uh, the EV only event at Caffeine the Machine. Uh, gonna go for a nice drive up there and take about an hour from here. Um, but thanks again to Northampton Audi and uh, be a pleasurable drive, I'm sure, and uh, some awesome cars to go and check out. So uh, let's go. Here we are at Caffeine the Machine. There is an amazing variation of uh, electric cars here. But yeah, we've got Tesla Mini that we saw at Late Break Show. We've got Moggy in his uh, very fast Defender chatting away to someone. You've got his uh, Beetle, the large drive unit. There's an XL1 here, which is diesel, so I'm not even sure why that's here. Um, there's a few uh, petrol heads with their motors. You've got RS6 and a few other random vehicles. Everyone's enjoying uh, some food at the top there. There's a few Ionic 5s at the top. Got the uh, Audi RS e-tron there. Uh, look at this beauty. Here we go. Shining in the sunlight. What do you reckon, guys? Impressive. Yeah? Yeah, very impressive. It's pretty quick as well, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Crazy fast. And we've seen it a couple of places already, of course, so uh, we know what this thing is all about. Electrogenic is here with their Triumph Stag, their E-Type, uh, VW Carmen, and uh, got an Everati Porsche here as well. So we've got a whole mix of cars. Um, did follow a Porsche taken in as well, in green. I think it was a turbo, which looked rather good. So yeah, it's a really good event. I was disappointed I wasn't here yesterday, but I was uh, filming Eco Classics, which uh, will be coming up soon on the channel, which is going to be awesome. This was making some uh, interesting noise earlier. It's very different from the other one, isn't it? There she is. And what a beautiful day we've managed to uh, capture. Look at this, blue skies, not a cloud in sight. Let's get some sun cream on in a minute. So yeah, we've got uh, electrogenic cars over here. Um, we've got a few Porsches up at the top as well. Hello, mate. And we've got Ian standing next to him. I'm good, mate. You brought a nice mix. You brought four today. Four. The stag down there as well. Do you want to swap me for the uh, Audi e-tron RS or any of them? Never know. <laughs> <laughs> so here we are up at the top bank, which a uh, few electric cars are hiding up here. And uh, the Audi RS e-tron that I borrowed from Vindus Group I had up here, but then I had to get it on show when it's, there was a space available. There was a couple of Porsche here, but one of them's gone. It's uh, that green one, but no, now there's only one left. It's uh, quite a cool uh, i3 over here, actually. I did notice it's got a few uh, uh, exterior styling mods. Obviously the iconic Ionic 5s looking rather smart. I do like them. So who does this? Stourbridge Automotive and Servicing Centre. Ah yes, it's got an AC Schnitzer rear spoiler. Looks quite smart. Murdered up as they say. Another Tesla that was at um, the EV only track day. Uh, that's it, DH0 Red. That looks smart, doesn't it? Without the chrome. Talked to a chap, uh, he was a Ford RS Owners Club member, and uh, I think he liked the look of all the uh, EV conversions, but I think uh, he think it's sacrilege to spoil any of the uh, Cosworths, of course. Let's go and have a little look 
down at the EV conversions down here. We've got Ian, Ian's uh, stag from Electrogenic, she brought down. Um, a Mercedes small line, I'm not sure who uh, converted that. Let's have a look. So yeah, we've seen this before. Oh, no mate. Might notice that engine bay. Do the start of the um, charge heads episodes. So what's this? The SL. Oh, I wonder if there's any info on this somewhere. It's got the uh, display that electric classic cars use. Sportline, we'll have to have a look into them. A bit of leaf action. The RSC Tron. There he dies. So, uh, some lovely diesels coming in now. Fantastic. They sound great and, uh, you know, do a great job on the old emissions, don't they? Full beer. It's absolutely stunning, this Defender. I'm going to run out of cars to uh, look at soon because I'm all, at all these events and there's only a few uh, EV conversions. Good job we've got the TVR wedgie build coming very soon, so keep an eye out for that. You don't actually concentrate too much on the inside of this car, but it is absolutely beautiful in here, quality-wise, and the fit and finish. Very nice indeed. Come along with Clive. Clive, what 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 did you think of the Audi e-tron RS experience? Yeah, it was not bad. Very very refined, very smooth. Smooth, refined. Yeah, yeah. That's what we like. Yeah. Uh, I haven't got I'll, another I'll shop, mic. I haven't got, I haven't got another microphone, so you have to just oh, okay. whisper in my ear. Uh, no, I mean, <laughs> what, I shocked you about? I shocked that you know when we were doing say 70, a fellow doing 50. Yeah, yeah. You did say that. You're like, oh, what speed are we yeah, going? Yeah, like, it was. We were going very, very smooth. Yeah, the, the legal limit, as always. Yeah, yeah, good traction as well. Yeah, 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 indeed. Um, but yeah, I think I think that's about it. I love the pace car, a bit of mini action. Not even sure on the spec of that. Hopefully, we won't see what's on this chap's phone. Anyway, I think that's. Uh, I'm going to try and get some more footage of the Porsche. See if we can uh, have a chat with the chap. Uh, have a word with the chap that brought it. Um, but yeah, and if anyone can tell me what that grey thing is with the gullwing doors. Clive, do you know? No, I don't. I've got no I'm idea. Sorry. I think I need to uh, do some homework. But well, there we go. Great event so far. did say that they were a um, nice price. Well, yeah, they're big examples of why. A 71 play. Oh, that's a new one. Nice rack on that whole side. Matches the calibre. 
See, let's try much more. We've uh, covered this car already, but I thought we'd uh, show another little uh, snippet. Taken to about S. So uh, the new uh, lot of cars are coming in now, uh, so it's time for us to make a move home. Um, so yeah, we met um, a rather famous YouTuber, which was quite interesting, I had a good chat with him. Um, so that was good, and uh, yeah, there was a nice mix of cars here. It was actually sold out completely, although it looks a bit quiet now, but there were quite a few uh, ice um, cars here, so whether they were interested or uh, going for, oh, there's my shadow. Uh, whether they're interested or just uh, come to see what it was all about, who knows, but, but what a lovely day and uh, if you missed it, let's hope there's another one soon. So back to reality, dropping the uh, Audi RS e-tron off at Northampton Audi and I know for a fact that the uh, charge heads uh, support vehicle is not going to feel quite as nice. <laughs> um, so here we go, but yeah, great event today at Caffeine and Machine. Um, then the next event's going to be um, EV event, so if anybody's got any ideas of what uh, other EV events are going on, then give me a shout. Um, but yeah, great to meet a few new people today, and um, yeah, check out the uh, Eco Classics episode which will be out after this one, and uh, yeah, more to come. Have a good day.